Hi guys, welcome to my grocery haul video for this week. I just picked up everything from Walmart through their grocery pickup and I'm gonna share with you what we're gonna have for dinners each day this week and share with you everything we got. I did go over budget this week. If you are new to my channel, I like to stay at $200 per week to feed my family of four, me and my husband and my two boys. So I did go over budget this week at $230, but we needed a lot of stuff. The pantry was looking a little bare, so I definitely had to stock up on some things. So I'll share with you everything we got. I'll share with you what we're having for our dinners. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you click subscribe. I share with you each week what we're having to give you some meal planning motivation. And Memorial Day weekend is this weekend, so I definitely had to get a few extra things for that, some treats. We have the end of year with the kids' schools, and so I'm gonna be taking some treats to the office. I'm gonna be doing some baking this week as well. So that's why I went over budget, got some more special things and stocked up on some stuff. So let me show you everything I got. So I got a ton of stuff. It barely fits on my counter. I have it piled high this week, but we are stocked for everything, breakfast, lunch, and dinners and some treats for the long weekend. So I will start over on this side. Back here, I got a bunch of different cake mixes, a devil's food cake, and a bunch of yellow cake. And like I said, I'm going to be doing some treats for the school. I will definitely make some videos of what I'm making for you guys, so check back. I needed some clear vanilla extract um, so that I'm making a, a frosting that I want to be white, so I didn't want to use my regular vanilla extract. Some chocolate pudding for one of the desserts. Cupcake liners, of course. I have a bag of chopped walnuts that we love for snacks on top of yogurts. A pizza. I asked the boys what they wanted for dinner this week, and they wanted pizza. It's been a few weeks, so got a frozen pizza. It's our favorite one, the DiGiorno pepperoni. Um, some chocolate chips for the sweets that I'm making. Some old-fashioned oats and this spinach. I'm gonna make some green spinach muffins. It's spinach, oats, um, no sugar, no added sugar, which I love, and the kids love them. It's bananas, give it a really good sweetness. So I'm um, gonna make some green muffins this week for our Memorial Day weekend. I got some burgers for Memorial Day weekend, um, just some frozen burger patties. Corn has been delicious right now, so I got some corn. Um, here is some sweetened condensed milk for some of my cakes and sweets that I'm making. A gallon of milk, we go through about a gallon a week. Two cartons of almond milk. Up here I got some seasoned french fries that I'll put these in the air fryer. Uh, when we do burgers, uh, my kids were asking, we haven't gotten frozen french fries that we've made at home in a long time. So um, it's fun getting these, kind of mixing it up this week. Some half and half for uh, one of the frostings that I'm making for the cakes. Worcestershire sauce, I was totally out, so it's for the pantry. Um, for the pantry, sugar-free syrup. I always make sure we have an extra one of these. It's my kid's favorite. This, I love this turkey. It's oven-roasted turkey. It's thin-sliced, and this is a big package of it. But last week, if you saw my grocery haul video, I got some protein bread at Walmart, and it's really, really good. I've ha been having it with my breakfast as toast, and I want to make some sandwiches out of it, so needed to get some deli turkey for that. Lots of bananas. Um, the green muffins that I'm making, like I said, they have bananas in it for the sweetener. And some strawberries. My kids, I've been making them smoothies every once in a while, so I got some frozen strawberries for those. Lots and lots of apples. Two bags of apples because we are totally out, and we love apples. I love them as a snack with peanut butter. My kids love them. My husband has one every day also, so we definitely need lots of apples. Uh, some zucchini down here for dinner one night. I have a bunch of these little yogurts, these two good yogurts, two grams of sugar for this vanilla one. Super good, and so many yogurts have so much sugar in it, so this one's really great with just two grams of sugar. Uh, cottage cheese, my favorite snacks. Um, some sour cream down here. Some more yogurt uh, down here. This one I get for the kids. It's just a light Greek yogurt. Uh, carrots for lunches and snacks. Avocados, we do a lot of avocados. Uh, black beans for burritos and some chickpeas. So I made these chickpeas um, 
I dry them and season them and then put them in the air fryer and it makes a really yummy snack, kind of like a crunchy snack and they're high in protein, high in fiber. So these are really good. So I'm going to make that little snack this week. Um, this Kodiak uh, waffle mix, really, really good. Another high in protein. So there's 15 grams of protein uh, per serving. So my kids love these. I make them waffles with that. Um, some tuna. I love tuna. I've been having it for lunch a lot lately. Um, just tuna. And then I mix in, I do hard boiled egg whites and I dice up some pickle and a little bit of mayonnaise. And that has been my favorite go-to lunch lately. Uh, these yogurt tubes, my kids favorite. I put them in the freezer and then they kind of eat them like a popsicle sort of. Got some chips for Memorial Day weekend. Got a big bag of pistachios. Uh, salami is what Zachary likes for lunch. We were out. We just ran out yesterday. So just in time, big thing of salami. Blueberries. We're going to do salmon for dinner one night. So I got this pack of salmon, shredded cheddar cheese that we always have in stock, uh, sliced cheddar cheese for cheeseburgers, a pack of chicken here that we will grill up for sandwiches and salads, some string cheese for snacks. We've got lots of snack stuff this week um, to keep everything stocked up. Big thing of mixed nuts. This will last us a few weeks. Um, big thing of strawberries. Strawberries have been so good lately. A big bag of pretzels. My kids just love pretzels. Um, under here is a box of eggs. I've been getting this big carton of eggs lately, like the last few weeks. Um, 60 eggs in here so really awesome and it's a really great value so i've been getting it by the box lately and i only have to get it about every other week so um that kind of just saves as well some bread for sandwiches for um, my son he likes just peanut butter sandwiches on this specific bread um buns for burgers sandwich thins for my husband's sandwiches for his lunch that he packs so these are all of the groceries, everything that we're having um, for dinners. We're going to do pizza. We're going to do salmon. I have some leftover broccoli and we do rice, kind of like a salmon rice bowl. Chicken. Um, we'll do burgers this weekend for Memorial Day. Lots of sweets that I'm going to be taking to the school. Um, green muffins this week. I'm super excited to make those. It's been a little while. So Here's all the groceries and everything we're having. I hope that you guys enjoyed this week's grocery haul video and make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new. I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye-bye.